Okay, welcome back. It's Big Al. I've got a challenge locking device called Uncle Billy by K1 Locks, and this is really take one because uh, I haven't tried this one yet. And uh, don't try to adjust your TV uh, or your laptop or your iPad or anything else you're watching this on because this is upside down. Um, I understand that um, I believe it's what William Mansell or Mansell that's. Um, um asked us to try to do a lock upside down so um this one as you can tell it's upside down so uh i have never just like the the other challenge that i uh, tried recently the um vice versa challenge um there's pretty cool challenges going around anyways besides the actual uh this is a challenge lock by uh k1 locks and uh i'm also going to try doing it upside down so i can enter the uh uh, William Mansell's um, upside down uh, challenge so kind of a double challenge I guess um, yeah I've never never ever tried one like this it's real weird um, which I guess is cool I guess I will try it uh, it'll still be clockwise I guess if I go this way like so well this is really awkward <laughs> maybe I'll just go this way I'm thinking and uh, I'm gonna try this Peterson uh, it's got the flat top to it I don't know if that's that's gonna do her but we'll give it a shot hopefully the, see I don't want to block the camera either and that's what's gonna happen okay uh, maybe I can go like this move my chair a little bit let's see that work Let's try. Oh man. Okay. Yep, that's really awkward. Okay. Yeah, and that's not big enough. I'm gonna try the gym. This is really, really weird. Okay, I did get a little, I think I hit probably pin three and got some, a little bit of a turn. That one feels set. See, I can't really feel the if I'm getting any counter rotation or anything. Okay, yeah, it was right there. Pin two. I might have got it. Let me try some more. Yeah, I think I might have got it. Hang on, buddy. I swear that cat knows when I turn the camera on. some good uh I think I got a good click there on that probably pin one got that slight turn back
Wow. That's so weird, man. <laughs> this is so weird. Oh boy. Yeah, I got some counter back there, right? Right here. I want to say it's pin four, maybe. If I can stay on it. I don't know if I got it or not. I feel like I got a slight, a slight bit of a false set, but there's some good counter. I can make it set. I feel like I got a slight bit of a false set, but. Oh, I can't feel it good enough to. I can just go off the go off the rim maybe. No. Nope. This is not going well. I got that slight turn back just now though. Oh, so awkward. It's awful. And I chose this one because it's got a uh, quick set keyway, and I thought it might be might be a little bit easier on me. But it's not panning out that way. I keep losing that that uh, false set and getting it back. That's all I'm doing. I'm going in circles. I'm not getting anywhere. Doesn't feel like it. <laughs> Just got it back again. <laughs> I lost it and got it back again. Oh. I 
That felt good. Yeah. Let's see if I can't get any kind of feedback. Did I had some? Oh. So awkward. Oh, dear God. This is the normal way for uh, what is it, uh, European? It's not for me. Well, let me try. Let me try going counterclockwise real quick. If that doesn't work, I'll just I'll call it. I can tension it better this way. Okay, I got that slight bit of a turn I had going the other way. Got a little bit more. Feeling pretty good. Better than the other way. Got some counter. I think. Oof. That was bad counter. Damn it. That slight turn back. Let's see if we can see if we can get some more here. A little bit more. Uh, I should have set the timer because I know this is getting long. Got a decent fall set. Yeah, I got a decent fall set. Come on, baby, send it home. There it is. Boom. Upside down. Okay. I don't know how much time we're into. I'm going to try to go ahead and keep this. 
I don't see why not. I'm going to go wide. And see if I can't keep this. Hopefully it ain't too stupidly long. I'm going to touch the screen and see if it tells me. I don't know. Uh, 15. Oh, you know what? Screw it. We're keeping it. All right, here. Might be a long one, but it's upside down, so what can I say? Plus, I spent a lot of money on this camera, so I don't have to worry about time anymore, so. <laughs> uh, okay, clip on the back. Oh. Want to play like that, huh? There we go. Jesus. Okay, we got a key, so. Oh, yeah, by the way, I didn't even show that, I don't think. There's the bidding on the key. Got a little hit of myself there. Uh, get a shim in there, hopefully. Bada boom, bada bang. Tell you what, that's a freaking, that's a trip, man. Doing it upside down. Uh, okay, we got some freakiness already on the on the key pins themselves. Get them laid out here. Hold on, buddy. Why do you always wait till the camera's on? Huh? Are you that smart? Yep. Yeah. Okay, on the core we've got threading in one, two, and five. Nothing on three and four. Threading on one, two, and five on the core. Okay, and get the shimmy shim out of there. And let's see what we got up top. We got a serrated, almost looks like a commercial serrated to be honest, but I don't know. Uh, two is a, definitely a homemade serrated. Little steel springs. Three is a uh, nice, um, one of them like cone shaped um, spool looking things. Four, another spool action, another steel spring, and five is, ooh, nice sharp top on that little sucker, yep, and another steel spring, and I'm guessing there's nothing done to the top because you'd have to get through there, yeah, there's nothing done in the Bible, okay, awesome. Put that over there, and we'll take a look at some pins. I'm going to go ahead and keep it right under this light, and I'll just bring the camera. Ooh, Again, that was um, Uncle Billy by K1 Locks, and I believe it was sent to me by Fast Charlie, so uh, thank you both, uh, K1 Locks, for making this awesome lock, and uh, Mr. Fast Charlie for sending it to me. I highly appreciate it. Freaking awesome. And uh, upside down to boot. <laughs> okay, uh, key pins. We've got a uh, we've got a serrated a couple serrations in the top of number one. We've got serration in top of number two, and then a reduced, almost like a T pin at the top of this one. A number two key pin. Uh, number three is a standard. Four again. It's kind of serrated at the top, and then it reduces down. Um, five. We can call that uh, multi serrated. I guess you can call that. And uh, Drivers, we've got a we got serrations on this end of number one, same in number two, really sharp end here too, by the way. And then it's like conical spool action on number three. 
and number four is another uh, spool and five we've got a uh, serration with a really sharp end on it right here like a like a sharp ring around the end there just awesome and the springs they do look fairly standard except for this one right here looks like almost like one of those uh, tangle freeze but it's a steel one it's different than the ones I got okay so there it is I'm gonna try to enter this into uh, William Ansel's uh, upside down challenge all right thank you all so much for watching and um, if you liked the video hit the thumbs up okay all right thank you all so much Big Al, signing off.